everybody. I decided to try my bath. A couple people asked if I would use this for a bath out on the road. No, it holds, it's too big. It wouldn't, you wouldn't have enough water with you to do that. This is all I would be doing is sitting in it and uh, showering. videotaping as you know it's clear you guys have one of these just scrub your head oh you have to get one it is the best and oh you know what I forgot I got a um, back scrubber from Timo and I forgot to bring it in with me and you know since I'm naked, I'm not going to get up and get it. YouTube probably wouldn't like that very much. I'm not even sure if I'll be able to uh, use this video. I'm not sure if you can see You know, you know. I uh, had a my semi annual dermatology check last week and had seven free cancers frozen off so i'm still healing from those but at least there's no biopsies myself for my face so This is so nice. Mm. Oh, and it came with a little blow-up pillow, too, to rest against, but I left it out there. Oh, this is just wonderful. So, a couple people mentioned um, keto and my weight loss. Yes, I have reached and surpassed my goal. My goal was 125, but now I'm down to 121. And I don't want to lose any more weight because I'll have to get all new clothes. And I don't want to do that. Um, 
but it just keeps going down. I suppose my body will decide what's a good weight for me. I don't know. But um, uh, a lot of people have asked, you know, are you still carnivore? Not really. I We still eat a lot of meat, but we also um, have vegetables. Um, just because I just... Um, got so bored on just carnivore, but I will tell you that Ron has lost 50 pounds He spent the first Four or five months on just carnivore and then like I said recently we've been um, uh, leaning more more towards keto and I'm okay with either one of them because um, You know I get more options once in a blue moon, we we don't do dirty keto. Um, like I don't buy fake bread or keto bread or anything like that because for me, um, any kind of grains really gives me inflammation everywhere. And so even like he had a beer left in his refrigerator. I may have already told you this, I'm not sure and well two beers and we each had one one day um thinking just carbs well for me it's not all about the carbs it's about um grains i cannot have grains it hurts me so bad um my uh arthritis just cannot tolerate them but the one thing we do cheat on occasionally like today is we had um, each had one low carb tortilla and just had like a breakfast um, burrito and it was yummy but I only do that like once a month I'm pretty clean the rest of the time just meat and veggies a little bit of butter usually not any um, oils you know, like olive oil, and I know oil's not bad for you in any way, shape, or form, but um, on carnivore, you wouldn't have oils. You would only do animal products, but like I said, we have the occasional um, broccoli or cauliflower. Um, uh, so, yeah, that's the update on the keto and the weight loss. I really encourage people to to try it. And a lot of people think it's expensive. I spend way less money on carnivore and keto than I ever did on the standard American diet. Absolutely way less money. Uh, because all you're buying is meat. And I buy the frozen broccoli because they're like 99 cents at Walmart. Oh, you guys, this is heavenly. Now, if I was out camping, of course, I wouldn't have this. I would have my pump one or one of the bottles, but it still does everything I want it to do. It catches the water. Right now I'm filling it up for a bath. I haven't had a bath in a while. Probably a year because I don't have a bathtub. So, anyway, this is remember the uh, Timo Timu bathtub, and um, there's several of them. They sell out fast though, so they are uh, a lot of people do like them. A lot of people use them for ice baths. I just don't get why uh, I would not enjoy an ice bath at all. That one is not fun. Anyway, um, hope you're all having a good day. Our nomad community had some um, bad news today. Um, I encourage you to go watch Blind View's latest video to find out what it is. It's not my news to tell, so I'm not going to tell it. But um, we're very, very sad. So, okay, that's it, you guys. Thanks for watching.